Hi everyone, today we're going to be unboxing the Wacom Intuos. It's the small tablet with Bluetooth in the mint color. Inside you will find the pen, the tablet, and the USB cord. In the back you can also see that it comes uh, with three software downloads that you can get directly from the Wacom website. And the software that you will receive is Clip Studio Paint Pro, Corel After Shot, and Corel Painter Essentials. So we're gonna get right into unboxing this baby. And basically what you'll find inside is just a box with your tablet. It comes shrimp wrapped in paper to protect it. And this is what the tablet looks like. And you will find your USB and charging cable. You can use this to connect your tablet directly to the computer to charge your tablet. Um, because you can also use this tablet without a cord because it's Bluetooth enabled. And it looks like it's just regular USB cord. And this is what the pen looks like. We'll remove the wrapping from the pen. And it feels really nice on the hands. It comes uh, preloaded with extra nibs on the back of the pen, which is a great new feature with the Wacom pens. My old Wacom pen does not have anywhere to put the nibs, so I always was loosing them because I will forget where I placed them. So this is a great uh, spot to have your nibs for replacement. It comes with two express keys buttons right on the pen. And this is what the tip of the pen looks like. Inside you will also find an instructional manual on how to download the drivers uh, for the tablet to be compatible with your computer and how to use the tablet overall. You will also find some extra information in there in different languages and I think it's just notices from Wacom and letting you know the model number and safety precautions. And that is all that you will find inside the box. Nothing else. So let's get right into this. So we're gonna uh, take the wrapping paper off so you can kind of see what this tablet looks like. And this is the mint color. I was stuck buying this one because they were completely sold out of the black, but that's okay. This tablet is six inches by four inches. And here's a comparison of it next to the Mac mouse and a Mac keyboard. This tablet comes preloaded with four express keys and a Bluetooth power button. You can assign any command or shortcuts to these express keys. Also the, on the back, you will find the Wacom name engraved and your model number. The awesome thing about this tablet is that you will be able to use the entire surface area to map it to your screen, unlike other older Wacom Bamboo tablets. Here is a Wacom Bamboo tablet in size comparison next to the new Wacom Intuos tablet. The surface area of the old Bamboo is a lot smaller as well for you to map it to your screen. Here is a size comparison of the pens. The old Wacom Bamboo pen is a lot thicker. The new pen is a lot thinner and also shorter. They both come with two express keys on the pen. And the new pen has nib storage, which the old pen didn't. And here we'll have some size comparison of it in length. So let's test out the pressure sensitivity of the pen. Wacom claims it has a 4096 pressure sensitivity. I have the pressure set to opacity, flow, and shape. And this is what it looks like on Photoshop. When you press lighter, it'll be a softer gradient. And as you press harder, it'll get darker. So I hope you guys enjoy this unboxing and I hope you will subscribe and come back to watch more of my videos. See you guys soon.